Well, hey, Man Cave, this is Bob from Bob's Enscale Man Cave, and we're doing a video today to announce what I'm doing in 2024 in the Man Cave and out there in the Man Caving world. So, I just got back from Amherst in Springfield, Massachusetts for that train show. It was a huge 28,000 people, so forth and so forth, depending on how you, who you're talking to. It was awesome. A lot of things to see, a lot of things to do, and uh, had a great time. Brought my first 25 foot long Fremo module, the first time ever setting it up in layout, and it worked out pretty well. Got some tweaks to do and so forth, but I gotta have that ready for Evanston in July. But we'll get to that later. Let's pay some bills. So, if you want a discount on your tr model trains, Go to anstrains.com. You've seen them at Amherst. You've seen them at other train shows, uh, Altoona, and so forth. Anything that end scale, they usually have it. They're usually there. So use this promo code, DeBob24, this year. Only works this year. And so put that into your promo code and your coupon code in the checkout on their website when you're purchasing your stuff. And uh, you get a discount. It varies depending on the manufacturer for the discount, so they'll calculate that at checkout. So, anstrains.com, you might find what you're looking for there. So, the next train show that I'm doing is in Denver at the Rocky Mountain Train Show. That's April 6th and 7th, I believe. And right after that is the Festival of Trains down in Oklahoma City. And that's the next following weekend. That's uh, April 13th and 14th. And that's a brand new train show uh, company that's been put together this year. And this is their first event. So we're going to try and get as much word out there as possible. And so try and attend if you're out there in Oklahoma City area to go. You can get a free ride from Thomas the Tank Engine. Adults, kids, doesn't matter. It's all free. No problem. And so, puppet shows, you got vendors, you got model railroad layouts, you know, HO and N scale and whoever else is there. I haven't seen a whole list of all the people that are coming yet, but I'm going to be there. And that's the most important thing, right? So, go ahead and uh, check out festoftrains.com. That's where you find out more information. I'll put a link down below. And... Uh, if you want to buy tickets in advance, that ticket link should be up this week, so you can buy your advance tickets. And the tickets are $15 for a single day and $20 for the whole weekend per person. I think uh, children 12 and under are free, so that saves you some money too. Uh, after that is the N-Scale Convention in Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. Uh, bringing my modules to that as well. That's going to be a great time as always. A lot of things going on at the convention and trips and everything else. I'll put a link to uh, that convention in this video as well. You can check that out. After that is Evanston 24, which is out in Evanston, Wyoming. And we have probably 70 people right now currently registered. We're expecting around 100 people to register to come to this show, they're bringing Fremo modules, there's N-Track, there's T-Track people uh, setting their stuff up as well. We've got a roundhouse and we've got a machine shop. Machine shop is all Fremo, huge. We're probably gonna have maybe 300 sections of modules on this uh, layout. It's gonna be very large. And so it'll probably take four or five hours to get around the whole layout just once. That's how big it's gonna be. So. Fun for all. Hope to see you there if you uh, plan on coming out. That's Evanston, Wyoming. That is the weekend or week of uh, 23rd to 28th July. So keep that in mind. And I'll put some links down there where you can uh, find out more information and register. After that is Altoona, Pennsylvania, which I'm not quite committed to yet. Uh, that would be three times out to the East Coast and through Pennsylvania in the one year. That's a lot of traveling. So uh, I'm not sure yet. Uh, after that is Train Fest in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Not quite committed to going to that one. There's no Fremo there, so it would just be me going up to do videos. 
and I wasn't too happy with the last last little train fest, but that's another story. Anyway, the next one after that, well, starts all over again. We got Amherst in 2025. And now, if there's anything else that might pop up in between there, I might go to, um, you know, just because it's local or, or something like that. So, um, it's not even talk about the local ones. It's not necessary right now. But anyway, hope to see you at all those train shows around and so forth. And that's where I'm going. So, the other things I'm doing is I'm trying to get caught up with all the videos I recorded and didn't edit and put up on my channel from last year. We got the whole series for how I built my uh, trestle bridge. I got a series on how I built my transition modules, how to build a, a simple module. And also a meet and greet video that we did out in Denver for YouTubers out, at the, out in Greeley and lots of, lots of different things that I haven't done yet. And I probably should have done that, but I, I don't like editing. Editing gets very boring and time consuming, so I gotta set aside some time to put some videos together for you. Also, I got some reviews that are coming out, like, uh, well, there's a SD40 2 from Scale Trains that should be arriving in the mail any day now. And so I'm looking forward to that. I gotta put something together for, the, for you. And uh, anything else that may be coming up, I don't really have any planned at the moment. But <sighs> a lot of work to do. So, if this is your first time visiting the Bob Zanscale Man Cave, consider subscribing down below and ring that bell as well to get notified of future videos like this one. And also, leave a comment, tell me what you liked, give me suggestions of places to go, and uh, also give me a thumbs up, I really appreciate it. So as always, Man Cavians, happy model railroading. You stay off those tracks. Bye.